<laughs> Good afternoon, everybody. It's been a beautiful morning this morning. The weather forecast says it's going to be a bit um, gloomy this afternoon, but hopefully we can brighten your lunch times with Cliff and Candy, who are going to put you through your paces, make you a better tennis player. Uh, thanks hey guys, for joining us. back today. Not sure if Craig's... Uh, we're just talking to him. Don't know where he is, but we'll get started. Hope you guys have had a good day. You're ready to get going. Um, Candy again, same same as usual. Candy's going to start us off, and I'll jump in, take over, and Candy will finish you off. All right. So enjoy. Let's go. Hi everyone. So today we're going to use a theraband. If you don't have one, it's completely fine. Um, we can just do, make do without. This one's quite long, so if yours is shorter, that's still going to work. Um, but just keep it handy for you. So pop it on the ground. We'll start off with our warm up. So feet heavy with apart, and we're going to breathe in. And on our exhale, rolling down. Nice and relaxed, soft knees. Bending as much as you need so you can touch the ground, and then exhale, rolling back up. Inhale. And exhale, down again. Inhale at the bottom and exhale back up. One more. We're staying down there, breathing in and exhale, rolling down. Walk along the ground. We're coming to our plank. We're going to hold our plank for our 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, two and one and we go into our downward dog so press through that downward dog lift your hips up to the sky hold that for ten nine eight seven six five four three two one and back to plank and then from there into our cat stretches so come on your hands and knees rounding your spine up to the sky Breathing out, inhale the other way. Belly button down, hips up to the sky, chest slightly forward and up. Again, go with the own flow of your breath. You might want to go a bit slower. You might want to go a bit faster. Two more. Last one. Back to the center. From there, we're going to stretch forward, reaching all the way forward, bringing that armpit down towards the ground, stretching as far as you feel comfortable going, and then change sides. Again, if you want to pause and hold for a moment, you can. Otherwise, you're going to keep this moving. Good. One more each side. and rest. From there, grab your band and line your side. You're going to pop one end in each hand, so keep it kind of loose. Bend your legs right up and just rest your head. From here, we're going into some book openings. Stack your hands and you're going to exhale, reach the one hand up towards the sky and then pull it back. Getting a little stretch through that thoracic and maybe a little bit through your pec and then you bring it straight back down. Gonna do six, so that's our third one. And just one more. Good, rolling over, other side, so same again. 
Stack your feet and your hips on top of each other. Stack your hands and then same movement again. Reach the hand up and exhale, come back. Good, halfway there. And our last one. Good, release it from there. Come and lie on your back, bring your band, place it over your pelvis. Feet hip width apart, hold on to the band. You can wrap a little bit so you've got a bit more of a grip and then you're just going to place it down across your hips and your hands down by your sides. So you'll feel a little bit of the back of the arms work. On your exhale we're going into our pelvic lift. So you're going to roll up pressing a little bit through that band making the hips work a little bit harder today and exhale rolling down. Inhale at the bottom again and exhale up. Again, we're looking at each little segment and we're trying to move it one point at a time. And we're just going to complete one more. And we're rolling up. Inhale at the top. And exhale, rolling down and relax from there. Good, from there, straighten through your legs. Reach your hands above your head. Hold your band a little bit wider than your shoulders and you can adjust the tension as it suits you. Reaching your hands behind you. From there, you're going to give your arms a little pull. Inhale and exhale, you're going to roll up. Roll forward. Give your band a pull and roll back down again, hands behind your head and give your band a pull and exhale rolling up and pull. Keep with that same pattern, rolling up and down at your own pace, remember to control your movement. Almost there. We're going to complete one more and then we'll stay sitting. Pull your band. Exhale, roll up. Rounding through your spine, reaching as far forward as you can. Pull your band and then rest from there. Bending through your legs. Keep your hands level with your shoulders and your band a little bit wider than your shoulders. From there, we're going to roll halfway down. So on your inhale, you sink through your lower abdominals and you roll halfway down. Go as far as you feel comfortable going and then exhale, you sit back up again. Up as tall as you can. Down you go. And up. We've got six and that's two. One more. And rest it there. Give your arms a second. Make some adjustments if you need. From there, we're going to add on. You're going to roll down and we're going to hold it. Roll down and hold. Pull your band six times. Six. Five. Try and touch your chest if you can. Four. Three. Two and a one. Good. Sitting up nice and tall. We're going to repeat that one more time. Breathe in and exhale, rolling down. And six, five, 
four, three, two, and one. Good, sitting up tall, give yourself a second, release those arms for a moment. Take an inhale and an exhale, and then we're moving on. We're adding on. You're gonna roll down and rotate. Rolling halfway down, and as you do that, you're gonna pull your one hand, pressing into the band, reach the band behind you. Coming back up, other side. Roll halfway down, rotate, and pull that hand behind you. Good, we've got six. One more. And rest up from there. Good, place your band onto the ground, come around and on your hands and knees. From there, we're gonna curl the toes under, bring your hands just slightly forward of the shoulders and a little bit wider than your shoulders, so not too much. From there, left from your lower abdominals and you're gonna lift your knees up. And then gently place it back down again. Lift your knees up, gently place it back down again. Three, four, five, and six. Good, this time we're holding for 10 counts. Lift and hold. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one and rest and we're going to do that one more time left and hold 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 and rest good we're going into a little tricep dip so from there you're just going to press down through the elbows your hips stay where they are press through your fingers and straighten your arms Inhale down, and up, three, and up, four, five, and just one more, six. Adding on, now you're going to go forward into a big tricep dip. Tuck your elbows down and face towards you, down all the way, and back up. Five, you're almost there. Four. Three. Two. And one. Good, and rest yourself just in child's pose for a second. Almost done, we're just going to finish off with a little bit of downward dog and then we're heading over towards cliff after our roll down. So come into your plank for me, holding there and then press your hips up and into your downward dog. Stretch through the back of your leg, holding that. Take one more big inhale and exhale. And this time we're going to walk our feet towards our hands. So we're changing a little bit. Walk your feet towards your hands. And then slowly roll up. Good. Inhale there. And exhale, rolling down. Inhale. And exhale, rolling up. And then we're going to hand over to Cliff. Good job, everyone. Well done. All right, guys. Uh, we're not going to need much equipment. We only need one thing today, and that is a chair or a ledge. Anything we're going to do, we're working on upper body again. So we need a chair for dips. Right, so just grab that. Right, we're going to also be doing four exercises today, not three. Okay, number one, uh, we call plank walks. I'll show you what I'm talking about. Uh, then the dips, 
Then we're doing military plank. Again, I'll explain that to you and burpees to finish off. All right, so first thing, plank walks. Get yourself in a plank position. Just like this. Now, what do we want from you guys? I'm gonna do it this way so you guys can see me. What we want, we don't, I don't wanna see that, where your shoulders are dropping. I wanna see you pushing up, nice and clench your bum nice and tight. And you're gonna walk sideways like a crab. Okay, we're gonna do three, four, five, and back the other way. One, two, keep pushing up through your shoulders. Three, four, five. Again, good for shoulder stability. In the next round, we're gonna do a lot faster. And obviously things are then gonna pick up and it starts to make it uh, work the explosiveness in the shoulders too. Right, onto the dips. We did dips last week. When we're doing dips, what we're working is tricep extension. Right, obviously if you're looking at a serve, tricep extension is fairly important. It's that last bit on the serve. Right, here we go. So 10, 10 dips. Here we go. One, trying to keep your back straight. Two, three, four, five. If you need to, you can bend your knees. Six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Right, so. Back into the plank position. Right, it's also called, I think, commander plank, some people call them. And it's down onto your elbows and back. Then alternate onto your left arm, right arm, or right elbow, and back up again. Two, down we go. Three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, good job. Last one. Everybody's favorite, just to make sure we get the heart rate up, some burpees. Okay, so we're going to start here. Start standing. Down we go. Push the feet back, bring up, and up we go. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, quick drink, get ready for round two and three. Just while you're getting your quick drink, we'll pop in with an ad break. Don't forget that next 7 th 7.30 next Thursday night, we have Tim Batty from Brighton Sports joining us. And Tim is going to teach you all about the strings you should have in your racket, what the strings you currently have and what tensions you should be using. So um, if you haven't registered for that already, you can register via our website or the Facebook page, um, the Rabbin and District's Facebook page. And we'd, and we'd love to have as many people along as possible. All right, back to you, Cliff. Thanks, Craig. All right, guys, round two. We're going to try and do things a little bit quicker now. So get ready. Here we go. Plank walks. Ready and five one way, five back. One. Keep pushing up through those shoulders. And back we come. Okay. Into the dips. And bend your knees if you need. Find that leg. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Military plank, ten of them. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Right, ready for burpees? We'll start up. And here we are. One, two, 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. Hope you're breathing as hard as I am. Go have a quick drink. All right, guys, one more round. We're gonna increase it though. So last round's gonna be quite tough, all right? 15 of everything. Obviously the plank walks, a little bit different. So we're gonna do two. We're gonna go there, back, there, back. Remember when you're doing it, you don't want your shoulders to be hunching up. Shoulders back and down like you have pockets in back of your shirt, you're trying to keep your shoulder blades in there. Really good for creating shoulder stability. And if you do that, it helps a lot preventing shoulder injuries. All right, round three, here we go. Last one, a little bit harder though, okay? And out we go, we'll do it a little bit slower, making sure we keep the shoulders up. And back we go, push into your shoulders. Don't want to see you collapsing. And another one. And back we go. Okay, good stuff. Onto the dips. And down. One, two, three. Can bend your knees. Again, too easy. Straight legs. Nine, ten. Five more. Four, three, two, one. And up. Right. Military plank. The shoulders will be burning now. Fifteen of them. Here we go. Up. One, two. Left arm. Four. Five, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. And 15. Woo. All right. One more. Burpees, 15. Last push. Here we go, guys. I know it's hard. Let's go. Down we go. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, three more, thirteen, fourteen, push, last one, and good job, well done guys, hard one today, back over to Candy. Well done everyone. So let's come and just take a kneel. So kneel on one knee. And then reach back and see if you can hold onto the back of your leg. You want to stretch through your quad. While you're just stretching through that, try to slow down your breathing again. Breathing in your nose and out your mouth. Watch your balance. Whoops. Breathing in your nose and out your mouth. Good, changing sides, same again, reach back, hold onto that foot if you can, and stretch.
Go ahead and release that from there. Come and sit for me. Just bring one leg out. Good. Reach over and touch your toes. So you can have a little hamstring stretch. If you can't reach your toes, that's okay. Just reach as far forward as you can. Good, changing sides. Reaching forward. Each side will feel a little bit different and that's okay. Good, release it from there. Just crush your legs and come sitting. Bring one hand forward, reach it across your body and then pull the other one in, stretching through your shoulders. Good, release it from there, changing sides. Good, release it from there, bringing one hand up and over, press on your elbow and you want to stretch through the back of that tricep. Good, release and change sides. release it. We're almost done with our stretching, last little bit, and from there you're going to reach one hand over, and you're going to bend like a mermaid through the side, stretching through all the way down through that side for me. Take a few, few breaths through that rib cage, opening up through the chest. Good, and into the other side. Good, release it from there. Place your hands on your knees and then close your eyes. Breathing in your nose and out your mouth. Taking big, deep, slow breaths and out your mouth. Try to sit as tall as you can. Two more deep breaths for me and then we'll be done. Breathing in. And out. One more breath. Breathing in. And out. And then slowly open your eyes. And then you're all done. Well done, everyone. Good job today. Well done, everybody. Thank you again to Cliff and Candy for another session. Cliff, we've caught your breath now. Yeah, I'm back, Craig. <laughs> <laughs> the laughter I heard meant that they were working hard. That's great. Thank you, everybody. Enjoy the rest of your school day, and we'll see you back here at 1 o'clock tomorrow. Bye-bye. Thanks, guys. Bye.